Hi all. So uh, we made these brackets last week for these lights. I did a few videos on how we made those brackets and we mounted the lights on these magnets. Now these magnets came with a, uh, a rubber bottom. Okay so these rubber bottoms supposed to be on there like that they kind of slide in there but uh, I took them off because that's pretty thick that's probably a good uh, eighth inch thick so uh, I suppose it would be great if you're worried about scratching up your your paint but it it says but it says in the directions here oh only made for slow moving vehicles so, you know, that's with the rubber on. So, I'm going to leave the rubber off. You know, I don't really care if the paint gets scratched up. That just looks like the magnets I had on my CB antennas back in the 70s and 80s. It looks practically exactly the same. They had like a thin, a real thin plastic coating. Like a just like a cellophane black cellophane and that usually peeled off you know and your trunk would get all scratched up because you had your magnet on your trunk you know so I'm gonna put this on the hood of the truck up on top so before I wire it in okay before I wire this in run all the wires and stuff I want to test it to make sure the magnets going to stick so I don't plan on going down the freeway so but you know just going down normal roads you're 30 40 miles an hour so I tied this cord on it so I can hold this inside the truck in case it falls off so I'm gonna do an experiment here I'm gonna put this on top of the truck and take a ride and uh, we'll see if it falls off and I'll take you along with me. Okay, see you in a bit. Okay, so we're outside now. And uh, I'm just going to put it up there. I'm hoping it doesn't fall off and swing down and break the window. So. Or break the back window. <laughs> so, okay. I, I got to climb up there and... I got a rag, so uh, I, I'm going to wipe off the water. It's been sprinkling here a little bit. Okay, so this is the top of the truck. And uh, I run into a problem here already. This, this outer edge here is curved. If I put it back here on the flat surface, angle the light down, it, it'll hit the truck. So... Let's get the light and see what happens here. Oh, that sticks pretty good. Oh, jeez. See, see, it kind of waddles there a little bit. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, that's not going to fall off. If I angle it down there. See, it's, it's right on that ridge now, too. So there's that empty spot. I think if I put it up here on this angled part, that I don't think that'll work. Let's try it back here, see if it's flat enough. See how that kind of wobbles there. If it ain't one thing, it's another. Back there it'll work. But now it's on that ridge. Let's see where that ridge ends. That ridge goes all the way back. Okay, so let's try it here first. See if it falls off. And then we'll try it up on that slanted part. Okay. And then I, I got that wire. It's going to go down inside the truck. So hopefully it won't break the window if it falls off. Okay, so the uh, cord's just closed in the door here. OK, 
okay so I got it up to 20 miles an hour I, I, I don't know if that's a slow moving vehicle or not but it's still on there we're up to about 25 now okay so we're getting on the freeway here see if I can get it up to speed I usually don't drive this thing very fast so we're up to 50, hasn't fallen off yet. That's a good sign, right? I think it'll hold just putting around town. big hill here. Let's see if it handles handles the big hill here in town. I live just off the southern shore of Lake Erie. We don't have a lot of hills here. We just got like a big gully running through town. And, and this is it. made it back let's get out and check it out okay so it's still up there so that rounded corner there that first part of the roof I don't think that would be a good a good idea at all but now that I get it out here it might not be a bad idea just to put them on here you know not on this rough stuff, but uh, maybe bolt a little piece of metal, sheet metal to the top of this and just put them right on there. Maybe after I figure out where I want them, yeah, I'll just drill some holes right here and just mount them right on the roof. Okay, see ya.